Hey everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Pagan and today I'll be watching uh, State of Play live reacting. And if you're joining me on stream, hello, welcome. Welcome to everybody who is uh, here on stream with me live reacting to State of Play. This is exciting. Um, I am interested in Hogwarts Legacy. I'm a big fan of the books, big fan of the series. This looks cool. I mean, generally, I actually think this looks like the Harry Potter game I've been waiting for. Generally, I, yeah, I, I think this looks like the, the Harry Potter game I've been waiting for. It looks like open world. It's probably my most anticipated game so far. This kind of reminds me, like, the best games that I've played for Harry Potter have definitely been on PlayStation 1 and PlayStation 2. And I just used to love them so much. Especially PlayStation 1, I played that game to death. I played the Philosopher's Stone on PlayStation 1 to death. So, I've very much been looking forward to a game like this. So I really hope this doesn't disappoint. I don't know if I have any expectations for this. I don't think I have any expectations for this. So I think that's probably a good start. <laughs> it's a good start important to just like go in on a level playing field and be like, nah, let's see how it is, shall we? And on Paddy's day too. Thank you State of Play for bringing me a Hogwarts Legacy State of Play on Paddy's day. Cheers friends. Also, for anybody asking, I'm a Ravenclaw. Here we go, here we go. Nice dark. Loving it. The theme. Lumos. In-game footage work in progress. Okay. What do you think you're doing here, humans? Okay. Is that friends? Maybe? A lot of beasts so far. That's pretty much Welcome all we saw. Welcome to Hogwarts Legacy. You're a new student at the famed school of witchcraft and wizardry. This school looks so cool. With ability to manipulate powerful ancient magic hidden in the wizarding world, you'll need to uncover what's behind the return of this forgotten magic and who is seeking to harness it to destroy wizard kind. As you may be the one that decides the fate of the entire wizarding world. Okay. It's but stressful. Before you can study magic and begin to solve these mysteries, you must create the witch or wizard you want to be. Oh, the character customization looks kind of cool. When you arrive at Hogwarts, you will be sorted into one of the four Hogwarts houses, Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, or Slytherin. After you settle into your dormitory, you will meet up with your housemates in the common room. Cool. You will then need to attend classes, and you do have some catching up to do, as you were starting Hogwarts late as a fifth year. So you are the new student. You'll begin your studies attending charms, defense against the dark arts, Love it. herbology, and potions classes, to name a few. Ah, oh, hello, class. Please welcome the newest rose in our garden. Shall we begin? Do the graphics look slightly welcome off to, to you? Just slightly. Now, this will be a I crucial don't know. year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident. We will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. The best way to Love practice him. is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Love it. Love this. You may begin. Not bad for a I beginner. don't know. Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. Here, you'll meet your professors and learn to cast spells, grow magical plants, brew potions, Cute. and more. In between classes, you'll be able to explore the castle famous for its secrets, enchantments, 
and mysteries. Oh, the castle looks so cool. You'll discover dungeons and secret passageways. Yeah, I like that. That's cool. That's cool. That will require magical skill and a clever mind to solve. We love some puzzles. We love them. You may love even a good find puzzle. yourself in iconic locations you've never been able to explore before. <gasps> yes, the elf kitchen. It's the late 1800s, <gasps> so while the, the common prefect's rooms bathroom? and classes may be familiar, most of your professors will not be. However, you may recognise a few faces. Uh, all in good fun. Once is that nearly headless lick? Join the headless hunt I'll be right there with them. It is nearly so headless lick. Sure to win them over. Uh, don't forget why I'm here, sir. You'll come to know this eclectic group of talented witches and wizards in class and while completing side assignments that are part of a special curriculum. One's designed to help you catch up with the other fifth years at your own speed. That's very cute. <gasps> Quidditch. Lumos. Very nice. Opportunities for adventure abound in the area surrounding Hogwarts. The magical abilities you learn to master through your schoolwork will soon become tested as you unravel a dangerous mystery by working alongside the accomplished and yet enigmatic Professor Fig to try and discover if the rumors of a mounting goblin rebellion hold any weight and if the safety of Hogwarts lies in the balance. I have opinions differ as to how great a threat he really is. Okay. Yes, love that. Love Our the goblins. Loyalists love it. are capable of so much more than people realize. The wizarding world of this era is fraught with dangers. Creatures corrupted by a magical force, powerful goblins, oh. and sinister witches and wizards, all willing to fight, even kill, to achieve their own goals. Wow, okay. In fact, there's an uneasy alliance between the goblins and dark wizards. You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who is this child? Are you not telling me? But perhaps you shouldn't involve yourself with that just yet. Let's go. So cool. Okay, yeah, I actually... Fuck. He's done all that with Reparo? Oh my gosh. <gasps> Enemies possess unique defensive and offensive abilities, Oops. including blasting curses, stunning spells, enchanted weaponry, and more. While this looks complicated, like in a group fight. Might enchant and incapacitate you. Shit. Mastery of the shield charm allows you to deflect ranged spells and direct weapon strikes. Counterattack with powerful stunning charms, allowing you to follow up with extended spell combinations. Students who become particularly adept at spell casting will find many ways to exploit their enemy's weakness. Are they like zombies or something? That was cool. Slam with Descendo. Roast with Incendio. Devastate your enemies using various finishes. You can even use the mysterious, powerful magic your professors do not understand to obliterate your strongest foes. Holy Mixed shit! Matching dozens of spells will let you define your combat style. On your path to become the ultimate duelist. I wonder how you swap between spells. Just... Be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. In addition to classes and spells, you'll have access to a deep set of upgrades, talents, and skills to aid your progression as a wizard. Very nice. Complete challenges throughout the world to earn experience. 
Level up your abilities by choosing talents to upgrade your spells, plants, and potions to increase their power. Decide which talents best fit your playstyle to allow you to focus on your favorite types of magic. You can also That's loot, cool. buy, or craft your own magical gear that will increase your offensive and defensive capabilities in combat. Gear can be upgraded and specialized to allow for greater abilities for your chosen playstyle. Use a strong, even motion when That's cool. It's very abilities. customizable, and I, I, I'm, I'm liking that. I'm liking that. Potions for Belgian and Beasts. This looks really cool. Spells are not the only tools at your disposal in combat. As you hone oh. your wand skills, you can continue to further your magical education at Hogwarts, progressing your development as a witch or wizard. Brew potions that can increase your power when you need a boost. That's cool. I love that idea. Grow and deploy magical plants to mob the battlefield and keep your enemies at bay. <laughs> Oh, that's so cool! It's like practical herbology. To incapacitate unsuspecting enemies. In beast class, you will oh, learn about a variety a of magical beasts you might encounter, both at school and as you explore the world surrounding the castle oh. and its grounds. The goal of today is to remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick. Safely. That's class. Learning and mastering broom flight is highly recommended so that you may travel around the world. That's cool. Quickly. That is cool. I want you to do my herbology homework. You're despicable. <laughs> Some abilities despicable. may be taught to you by students who become your friends. As you develop relationships with these schoolmates, they can accompany you on your journey as your companions. Oh my god, this looks crazy. I'm and not a time, massive fan of the combat, but I do like it. This is our chance. Natsai Onai is a brave adventurer driven by the justice she seeks. Oh, no. Poppy Sweeting has a kind heart and loves magical beasts, oh. connecting with them more easily than with humans. But what happens now? Unafraid of detention or breaking the rules, Sneaking in the restricted section again. is Sebastian Sallow, a charismatic Slytherin with an over this boy, Hufflepigs hey. cannot reverse a curse with a troubling family secret. Nothing can. The sooner you accept that reality, the better. You'll meet these students and more as you explore cool, cool, common cool, cool, rooms, cool. hallways between classes, and regular gathering areas. Oh my gosh, she can get Welcome to go into to the room, room of requirements. Of requirements. Also, was that Peeves in the One Jester of the most outfit? Remarkable secrets of Hogwarts is known as the Room of Requirement. You're introduced to this space that seems to sense what you need. This is so cool. It for you. Oh my god. Since you need to catch up to your peers, the room provides space for you to sow and harvest plants, brew potions, and upgrade your gear. Oh my god. A helpful house elf named Deke helps you discover vivariums that allow you to nurture your own menagerie of magical beasts. Oh. What is it? Deke isn't sure. Only one way to find out. You can freely customize this space to reflect your personality and magical specialties. Oh my gosh, so cute. Oh my goodness. With the little cat. Oh, her flying on the hippogriff is so cool. Is that a dragon? Everything you need on your journey is available at Hogwarts. You'll want to visit the nearby wizarding village of Hogsmeade, where <sighs> loads of shops and vendors can provide you with the supplies you require. Is any is everybody else Potions seeing this? And recipes, to seeds for magical plants, to all sorts of gear. Oh my gosh! It's oh that was class. Did you see all the straps? But Hogsmeade also Cute. has its dangerous side. A band of dark witches and wizards, emboldened by the turmoil of the times, wander the village outskirts. You must avoid them or defeat them. As you explore, you'll find the world surrounding Hogwarts is alive with activity, wonders, and areas of unusual interest. As the school year progresses, dynamic seasons and climates will fill the sky with lightning or sunshine. Okay, this is or this is the class. ground with snow or rain. Oh my god. Unique wizarding hamlets pepper the countryside, <sighs> each with vendors and the broom ex who have exploration is tell, so good though. And missions with which they could use your assistance. Be on the lookout for enchanting magical puzzles that may very well have been designed by Merlin himself, 
when he was a student at Hogwarts. Very cool. Magical beasts roamed the lands outside the castle walls. Oh. Some have been corrupted by a mysterious dark magic, while others are at risk of the corruption. Thing reminds me of Horizon. If you're feeling benevolent, you can rescue them and restore them to health <gasps> in the Room of Requirement. Oh my goodness! But there are dangers beyond your understanding in the world as well. That's Dungeons true. and vaults hold perilous threats and also untold rewards. Be careful where you choose to explore, as it may lead you down a darker path. Oh. <gasps> Master spells. You can't use that Friend spell. Allies, journey across a landscape never seen before. Oh, I love the hippogriff. Ancient secrets, combat mystical threats, learn long forgotten mysteries, become the witch or wizard you want to be, as you leave your unique mark on the wizarding world. Holy shit, there's the dragon. Yeah. In Hogwarts Legacy. Oh my god. What? The VM Holiday 2022. Oh my gosh, it's coming out this December. Slash holiday season. That was your first extended look at Hogwarts Legacy. Now let's hear from the real wizards and witches behind the game. Oh, that was so cool. That was very, very cool. I'm like a little iffy on the graphics, but it's it's a massive open world game. I think like, the what can you expect to really? And the passion and the love for this brand that the team has is astonishing. That's class. I love her nail polish, by the way. Our so team cute. is so excited to take all of the love that they put into this as fans and give it to fans. This is the game that they've dreamed of for 20 years so cute love this you're teary the lore of the wizarding world is already so rich the artwork is all fantastic. we had to do was harness those elements and build Community a game manager? Out of it. oh cool the movies the books they all touched me in such a way like it makes me want to go that. to experience hogwarts it makes me put in so much more detail <gasps> they've put the their story. houses next to their names the concept art man wow we really want to make sure oh. that anything we add or anything we play with or anything that we explore really feels authentic bringing to life just the charm and the love of everything we have for the books and then marrying that with the iconic experiences from the movies the first three movies were just incredible it's really just the perfect handshake between the two Wow. Just the discovery of like seeing things portrayed for the first time. Maybe they've read something and had a picture in their head the whole time, but then finally to get to touch it. Walk this is very it. cool. You've got all these elements that can come together to create this amazing AAA open world action RPG. When it comes to the open world, it just we just knew it wasn't going to be enough to just stare out of the windows of Hogwarts and wonder what it's like out there. But the final question that fans ask is, what's beyond that? What's it's beyond so, the it seems so big. What's going to be beyond Hogsmeade? What's beyond the Black Lake if I start traveling south? Oh my god. And we just felt like we had to answer those questions. Oh my god, this is going to be a huge game, isn't it? I fucking love that. We were creating a real wide palette of opportunities and ways to explore the world. You're going to see different stories that are really exclusive to who you were in the world. Hogwarts Legacy is an original story that takes place in the late 1800s. You are a new student who is starting at the famed School of Witchcraft and Wizardry as a fifth year, which is very unusual. The narrative director so and the game director are both an Ravenclaw. And a bit of a mystery. The original story that we tell in the game is your story of what you did, you know, in the wizarding world that you haven't seen before. Or make our own magic with our story we're trying to tell. Fans are familiar with the wizarding world from you know the 1900s and on really mm -hmm. but now with this world we're able to sort of create a space that's their own i mean to Fans be fair that looks incredible that ancient magic has been around for a long time to say the least and that hogwarts itself is a stronghold of ancient magic and the avatar the player has the ability to sense it and possibly wield it or control it our process of development cool. started with rereading the books. And over development, we reread the books many times. Every time we'd start with a new feature, we'd dig oh, into that. Man, the kitchen. The, we would go into the prefix the bathroom. So cool. Hugs me. 
being able to put our own spin on what this universe is was a pretty big deal. Yeah, I that's cool. Design a piece that nobody has the ever common seen. Common rooms before. look amazing. The common room. You know, as a Hufflepuff, you always wonder, like, what what is my common room supposed to look like? It's close enough to the world that True. we know that fans will recognize certain names. They'll recognize spells. They'll recognize certain locations. I recognize that doorway. I recognize that classroom. But mostly, it's going to be an entirely new wizarding world that no one's ever experienced. Oh, I love that. When people love engage that. in the wizarding world, what's the one anchor? Like, what's the thing that everyone comes back to? What's the thing that grounds it all and grounds all these characters and grounds all these figures? And for us, we really felt like that answer was Hogwarts itself. That school, that famous school of witchcraft Thousand and wizardry, percent. is really what binds it all how to bring Hogwarts to life. That was a very big challenge because as everybody knows, Hogwarts is huge. Now we need to know exactly how this passage connects to this passage for game because you're going to have to walk it. And of course, oh my again, gosh. the Sentient Castle, it's, it's got new surprises up its sleeve. That's it so to cool. Keep its on its toes. We put so many little secrets and passageways and rooms in this castle. Oh, I love that. We recreate those very important locations and then there's these other places that are only mentioned in the books or just alluded to. And we have to make the connective tissue that brings all that together. That's class. Adding a world that is a breathing, oh, living look world at them. is very hard to do because it's all about the details. And as a concept team, we really cool. got into those details and studied history, studied architecture. I hope that when fans play the game, they get a, as lost in it as I do. I can just be reviewing a side mission, and all of a sudden I find myself wandering Hogwarts for like 45 minutes because it's so beautiful. Class. The community is absolutely going to love Hogwarts Legacy. It's going to be so fun. Get that letter to Hogwarts and go to Hogwarts. We're so excited for people to come to this, to inhabit it. To I'm excited to play it. Built. This is your Hogwarts Legacy. That is amazing. We truly hope you enjoyed the Hogwarts Legacy State of Play. I did. Our team is so grateful for the excitement and for the passion that all of you bring to this. It's truly what fuels us. That's class. On behalf of our team at WB Games Avalanche, we want to thank you for being here today, and we'll see you at Hogwarts. <gasps> okay. That's our show. We hope you're excited for the magic to come. See you next time. Oh my gosh, that was so cool. Okay, that was really, really cool. I have to say that like there's parts of the graphics that I'm like, is that the best really? But going through the rest of that state of play, I actually do see that it, it is wonderful. It, it does look fantastic. I love the environments like Hogwarts, especially with the room of requirement and the common rooms that looks so cool and exciting to explore freaking you can get on a broom and explore or a hippogriff clearly i'm very excited i'm very very excited the combat looks interesting to me i'm probably not the best with um i'm probably not the best with combat in games anyway but that looks interesting if not difficult in a in a in a giant scenario so i'm wondering if i'll probably be any good at that um but i'm very excited to find out i'm sure that there is a, a a way i'm sure that i'm sure there's a really good tutorial that would be cool i love that you can you can um grow plants to help in combat you can brew potions to help in combat that's cool i really like that they're using like practical uses not just inside the classroom of like your potions classroom or your herbology class like you're actually using it practically out in the real world to, to combat people. He did use the Avada Kedavra spell, which does interest me because it is a forbidden curse. So why are they using it? And also I'm out and I think Hogsmeade, he came across some dark wizards. They were all trying to use Crucio as well, which again is another forbidden curse. But like, ah, it's very strong. Like it's, it's super strong for, for those characters to use that, especially for the main character, the protagonist to use an Avada Kedavra spell. That's a little, a little dicey for me. But at the same time, the rest of that combat did look pretty brutal. <laughs> you remember like he was like throwing around a goblin, I think? Was he throwing around a goblin? That looked pretty, 
pretty brutal. So that's exciting. Um, I'm very much looking forward to it. I think this looks really cool. Um, like it. I don't think I have anything else to say other than that, that it looks exciting for me. The environments look really cool. I'm very interested in exploring this. I think this is going to be an open world game that I will probably pour hundreds, if not thousands of hours into. Probably hundreds. But this looks really, very cool. I'm most excited about Hogwarts. And exploring all the passages, all the puzzles, all the common rooms, creating different characters, maybe playing the story multiple times. Yeah. This looks stuff. Okay, I can't wait it. I can't wait. Oh, the release date. Some, sorry, people are in the chat being like, um, oh, somebody in the chat also said, make graphics better. <laughs> so I guess I'm not alone in that. Um, uh, holidays, December, Christmas or Thanksgiving, please do a lo an option for low graphics. That'd be cool. Um, interesting interesting reaction in the chats as well so uh, yeah this is very exciting for holiday 2022 i can't wait to play it can't wait to get my hands on it very much looking forward to it let me know what you guys think down below in the comments if you are watching this on youtube uh stream i'm about to go through all of your chats uh, as well and see what you guys thought too and i'll see you guys next time bye